to the Yurunga News, the news show that brings you the news that doesn't make the news. This week I'm joined back with my red bow wait, 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 no, kids are back, Mr. Wilbur, I thought you knew this, we're now running this show. Oh, but what about me? What? what? No! Now that we've taken care of that, let's see what the other kids have been up to. Good afternoon everyone, my name is Zoe and I will be showing you all of the hard working 3, 4 and 5, 6 kids on the site today. I mean, some of us are working. must be going crazy with all the kids back at school. Going crazy. A couple of the three, four students went and interviewed some teachers about how they feel with the students back at school. This morning, I was just here to ask a couple of questions. What's it like having all the younger kids back today? Um, do you know what? I think this has been the best week of term two so far and it's lovely to have things feeling almost back to normal. That's wonderful. What's it like having Olivia mark a lot of names off the roll <laughs> this week? Finally, Olivia is busy and earning her wage. She has been so slack this term. <laughs> yep. Uh, Tom, do you want to ask any questions? <laughs> I think we might, Tom might have got a case of the giggles. Well, have you heard of Mr. Raisin hosting Lego Masters? From what I understand, for many kids that have been on site, Thursday afternoon is their favourite time of the week with the great host of Lego Masters, Mr. Raisin. Well, I hope by next week we'll have a Lego Masters series, don't you? And I hope that next week we might even find out who the Lego Masters champion is. Yes, I do too. Thank you, Miss Waterman, for bringing us this interview. Anything you want to tell anybody? I hope to see the three to sixes back at school soon. Thanks, Akira. Stay safe. Bye. Bye. I mean, it's been really busy. Over here, you've got like tons of sanitizer. What are you doing today? I am really busy today and I'm putting away the hand sanitizer because Ms. Waterman doesn't seem to have the time to do it, so I'll do her job for her. <laughs> Well, this is an antibacterial hand sanitizer that kills 99.999% of germs. That's wonderful. Yes. I hope everybody uses the this hand sanitizer so they don't get germs, part. don't you, Olivia? I do hope they do that. And wash your hands properly, everyone. We will. From the germs. Thank you, um, Olivia. Stay um, safe. Thank Thanks for the tips. Bye. Bye Jay. Today is me and Kira asking you what's it like having all the students back at school. Um, it's been okay. Um, it's been a bit tough because I don't like most of the students. But, um, you know, you kind of get used to after a while and the smell you guys have. You know, it's not too well, bad. today we have Thomas coming in to ask you some serious basketball questions. Thomas? Oh. Um, here's my yeah. question for you. Why are you always push me away in basketball? I always push you away in basketball, Thomas, because you always foul me. You always try and tackle me. Well, Miss Jane, how does it feel making kids get injured in basketball? Uh, to be fair, I didn't make any kids get injured. We were running around and you tripped over your own feet. Hey! Okay, Mr. J, who's your favourite student in the school? I don't have a favourite. I dislike you all equally. That's great, Mr. J. Anything you want to say to these people? I don't really dislike the students. They're all pretty cool. Okay. Glad to have you back. Bye, Basketball Jordan. See ya. Oh, take that. Bye. Bye. Bye, Michael Jordan. There is a new business starting at the school. Here is Taylor being interviewed about his product by Mr. Lawback. Hello, yes, and welcome back. Uh, it is me back with the red bow tie that has been missing for quite a few weeks. You may have noticed uh, today it popped up. Uh, it did seem to go missing thanks to some other ratbag students, but I've got it back. 
So I'm here now with Caleb, who has been very generous in offering his services in bow tie making, and you might see them kicking around the school at the moment. Caleb, can you tell us a little bit about why you made a bow tie? So I can, I can see it in one of the episodes of Mr. Law back to me missing his bow tie, so I decided I like his red bow tie, so I wanted to make one for him, for the run the news. And it does look fantastic, so if there is anyone who would like a bow tie, can they order them anywhere, Caleb? They can order, just go, come to, I don't know, room five and then go to the first table and you'll see me. And I've even got one myself. And have you had a few different orders coming through today, Caleb? Um, I've seen a few different colours of bow ties kicking around. I don't know where my list is. Um, it was big. One, it was very big. One was Miss Waterman, which I didn't actually... There were so many people who asked today that I didn't even make them a bow tie. I only made one bow tie today properly, which was Michelle's. Ah, so there's a bit of a waiting list, so please don't be in a hurry if you do need your bow tie anytime soon. But get your orders in. Caleb's your man. Thanks, everyone. Back to you in the studio, girls. Here is our weekly dose of Lego Masters. Welcome here to the Yuranga News. I'm here for the Lego Masters Yuranga with Thomas O'Connor first. Tom, tell us what your team and you are building. Okay, this is Moppy from a disruption. He's a bad guy trying to attack this piece. What? And this part is a bad guy from that one. That's a bad guy too from that same team and that too trying to steal Yap to get away. Gosh. That's a, a wow, team. Um, he's a person who bit turns to a bad guy. That's a guy which is very rotten. Into Whoa, into what happened station. to that petrol station? And then uh, this guy exploded. The, this van um, crashed into that. It exploded. Thank you, and then, Tom. And then this is a beat tunnel. Yes. Bye bye. Thank you, Tom. Bye. Hope you're filled in. Okay. Bye. Bye. Bye, Mitchell. Today we are filming you for your own Lego Masters. Tell us how your film is going. Rolling with a dragon. What's this house over here? It's going to be annihilated by all these aliens and all these That is amazing. What? Is this a, the big alien? That's the robot. That is for your mom. Well, I hope your build wins us too. But Scott, what is the dragon over there? Scott? Okay, thank you very much. To the next build. Bye. See you, Mitch. How would you rate your build today in the 20... Weather. Weather. This week's weather is being brought to you by the press. My name is Lily. Yesterday it was Thursday and it was sunny and cloudy. My name is Zach. And today is Friday and it's sunny. My name is Indy and on Saturday it is going to be sunny. My name is Bailey. It will be raining on Sunday. My name is Summer. On Monday it's winter and it's going to be raining. My name is Nate and on Tuesday it's going to be sunny and cloudy. Rally on Wednesday, it's going to be sunny. That was the weather. Back to you. Time we have for this week. See you next week. Bye.